Hi, my name is Maria. Welcome to She Loves Biscotti and Pizza. Here we are again, another week, another pizza. It's the summer and right. today we thought of sharing a very summer pizza with all of you using cherry tomatoes, pesto, and basil. And I'm here with my friend Carlo. Hi Mary. Hello Carlo, how are you? Very good. <laughs> so today we're, we're basically you know, having a cherry tomato pizza, which is cherry tomato, fresh cherry tomatoes, garlic, chopped garlic, uh, parmigiano romano cheese, olive oil, uh, pesto, and uh, grated mozzarella cheese. Uh, all the ingredients we're gonna do is I'm gonna put them in a frying pan and I'm gonna saute them. I don't wanna, I'm not fresh, because fresh gives you a lot of water. So when you do it in a frying pan, it's, it, uh, it absorbs the water, so which it gives you a nice tomato over it. So we'll, we'll mix the tomato, the garlic, and a little bit of pesto, the olive oil, in a frying pan. And then we'll put it on top with a little, a little bit of pesto first, put it on top, and then the grated cheese will put it in the oven. Our cherry tomatoes are sautéed. Yes. And I have to mention that uh, if you go to the blog, I also have a recipe for cherry tomatoes that you uh, broil or bake, if you wish, or roast. Roast is the right word. Yeah, roast. You want roast the cherry tomatoes. But uh, make sure that, the, well, my opinion is you cut them in half because if you leave them whole and then you go in and take a bite, it might squeeze everything. Yeah. So I think it's better you cut them in half. Yeah, absolutely. So what I do is I'll have the pizza, so we'll uh, put some pesto on the pizza, no tomato because it's going to be fresh tomatoes. We have a pastry, uh, pastry brush. Pastry brush, they're not expensive or you could use a, or you could use your the spoon like this. The back of the spoon. Yeah, so it's all up to you. So about, you know, maybe two, two and a half, you know, spoons of pesto. Then you have, you see if you notice there's no water, there's no liquid, so the tomato are all dried up because you don't want a, a soggy pizza. We just sauteed the tomato right now, fast, fast. Best, sometimes it's better you wait a little bit, but we're gonna put it right away in the oven because when the tomatoes are hot, sometimes it cooks the... The crust of the pizza. Yeah. The pizza dough. Pizza dough. A little bit of mozzarella. So we're looking at about a quarter cup, a third of a cup. Yeah, a third of a cup. Add a little bit of parmesan cheese or romano cheese. So another tablespoon or so. Yep. And then we'll finish it off with a little bit of basil or uh, you know a little bit of oregano. Uh, to garnish. To garnish. It. So it's going in the oven. In the oven. So here we are. The pizza is out of the oven. Put it over here. Over this. So the smell is incredible. Well, what I, I like to do is, you know, finish that off with a little bit of romano cheese or parmigiano cheese, and all the kind of you have home. A little bit of fresh oregano, and a little bit of olive oil. So just a drizzle. Just a drizzle of the oil. And and it it just ties everything yeah, well, together. Yeah, anything you put fresh on top of a pizza. It's always, you, that's the one, that's the thing you're going to uh, taste it first, it's whatever you put fresh on the food. And we're going to put some basil on, on And there? we're going to put basil on top too, yeah. So. By the way, if you know, you want it upgraded a bit, like I said, you could always put, you could get some bocconcini, cut it in little slices, put them on top without putting it in the oven, because uh, the pizza's already hot, so you always get like that basil and fresh. The smell. And the smell. Like tomato, cherry tomatoes are, are fresh, everything's fresh. The smell. You hear that? I heard it. Yeah. And uh, that one I heard. There you go. So a cherry tomato pizza with basil and mozzarella. Uh, we hope you guys enjoyed this one. Leave us some comments below. Let us know what you're thinking. Let us know. Let show us actually. Show us. Yeah. Make the pizza. Take a picture. Show us. Yeah. How Can it turned out. Do the recipe. Yeah. Make the pizza. Maybe it'll be yeah. uh, you know like I mean everybody has a different taste. And uh, show us what uh, what you guys do. So that's it. So get out of your chair and do something. Make pizzas, Make guys. Make pizza. That's why Mary 
got me out of my chair and I'm doing something. <laughs> <laughs> right. Have a great week, Ciao. guys. We'll Thank see you, you again next Bye -bye. week. Bye-bye.